So you probably know how effective adding product comparison tables to your affiliate website can be at increasing your Amazon Associates earnings. However, after looking around, you probably also know how time consuming it can be to create one simple chart. In addition, if you aren't using the right tools, the charts that you spend hours to create don't really look that good. Well, now everything is about to change with Table Labs, where you can quickly create product comparison tables that look stunning. When you log in to Table Labs, you'll have a chart dashboard that will show all of the charts that you've previously created, along with the number of views that those charts have had, the number of clicks that they've had, click-through rate, and more data. So it really is a wealth of information for the charts that you're creating. However, what I want to highlight is how quickly and easily you can create these tables. So you just click the add chart button and once you've input your Amazon API details, you'll be able to select from the Amazon tracking ID or add a new Amazon tracking ID that you want to use. Of course, you want to add a title to your chart. And today we're going to create a chart on survival knives. So let's call this best survival knife and then all you do is click add products and here you can quickly search so I'm going to do a search for survival knife and this will pull in information directly from Amazon and you can scroll through these to see which ones you like the best if you want more information you click on the information and it shows you everything that's within Amazon including the reviews so you can do all of your research here uh, you can read the reviews and see all the details. But once you've done your research, it really is as simple as adding the products that you want to your chart. So if you like this knife, you click add and that's added. I like the Amazon Jungle Survival Knife with sheath. Of course, I will add that as well. Let's say you have specific products that you know about. Uh, I've got the Gerber Bear Grills. I know that's a survival knife that's in here as well and I know it's a good one so I'm gonna click that right there uh, and the, let's go let's maybe do some fixed blade survival knives so you can um, select all the products from one search or you can do multiple searches uh, and look at these different ones the m -Tech is a good seller I just happen to know that as well as the Shrade Extreme. But let's say on the first page of results you didn't see anything that you like, you can just show more here and that's going to load the next page and uh, we're gonna add the Smith & Wesson Search and Rescue. So now that we've got all the products that we want, we just click Done. And as you can see, the, the table really is already created. Um, now it's just a matter of what order do you want these in? Do you want the price to be over here? Would you like the buy button to be over here? Do you want to completely delete the title row and the rating row? You can do that, or you can add those columns back. Or you can add a custom column in here. Let's say you wanted to look at the information and uh, see exactly you know, how long the knife was or how thick the blade is, um, all sorts of different information. Uh, that you could you could do there and of course call it anything that you want We'll just delete that for now You can of course rearrange the um, order of the knives or of the products and In any order that you want Just a simple drag and drop you'll notice I haven't used any code at all up to this point point. and let's say my favorite knife under my top pick column is the Gerber Bear Grylls knife um, I can also change the text that I want on here. If I don't want it to say buy now, I can say um, get on Amazon, right? And that will change all of it. Or let's let's do let's do buy on Amazon. Buy now on Amazon. There you go. You see that I've taken a little bit of my time, but really. I'm, I'm done. I can now preview this current chart if that's the way that I want it. Or just as quickly, I can change the look and feel and preview that. Now, of course, I should also add ratings here. 
And we don't pull in ratings directly from Amazon because that actually is against their terms of service. Uh, but what you can do is look at what other people have rated these knives at, and they've given this a 3.1 stars. And so if I wanna trust their ratings, sure, I can put a rating of three there, or I can go through and do my own rating system. But you have complete control and flexibility over how you wanna rate each and every product within your comparison chart. Once I've created my chart, all I do is copy the embed code to my clipboard and then go. I go to my website and paste it in. So if I'm going to insert my chart on a WordPress site, I just come over to my WordPress editor, make sure I'm in the text tab, and then I just paste in the code. No need to install any plugins or anything else. You just hit save on your work and then you can view that live on your website. And as you can see, the chart comes out exactly how we uh, designed it to look. And if you click on the title image or the buy now button, you will go over to Amazon and be able to purchase that uh, and it will be under your affiliate ID. Now, if you don't like the way that chart looks, I think I wanna edit that just a little bit. In fact, let's change uh, the theme and I want the picture to be first and uh, the price, that looks good. I've decided that I want this to be my top pick. Um, and so I'm, I'm done with that. Uh, I'll come back over here and just hit refresh. No need to get new embed code or anything. Uh, those changes are made automatically. And as you can see, I've got a beautiful looking chart that really only took me a few minutes to make and it's effective. You'll have more people clicking on your links, more people buying on Amazon, and you've just saved yourself a lot of time.